Okay, y'all, it's a double review. Come through. It's a two brand new slay featuring Glam Shay. Y'all, it's a collaboration video. I am so excited. You keep getting low on your phone. You and I just spending my moan. See, fair out of you, made no flow. Said days keep burning, and the smoke fills our flows. Waiting in the water, I've been drifting out to sea. You see my vibe and seas, but a lot of them be floating in the day. But highs inside these eyes, I seem to glisten while they wait. Losing sleep as this reality is taking over me. Hey you guys and welcome back to Half Baked Hair Reviews. I'm Angelique. If you're returning as always, thank you so much for tuning in. And if you're new to this channel, just make sure you smash that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when I upload new videos weekly. So today I'm coming back to y'all with something a little bit different. This is my first collaboration video. I'm doing this with Glam Shay. We both decided to pick up these two brand new Bobby Boss units and give y'all a double review slash collaboration video. So I'm super excited about this. If you guys do not follow her or you're not subscribed to her channel, channel just make sure you head over there check out her reviews check out her channel she's super positive she's super beautiful she's such a wonderful person and i'm so excited to be collaborating with her so let's just jump into the specs on these units so y'all these units are made exactly the same as far as cap construction is concerned the only difference between these two new units is going to be their wave patterns so this one that i'm wearing on my head right now is the mlf 433 Brienne and the color number two and the other unit that I popped on was the MLF 432 Patrice both of these units are in the color number two so the cap construction on these you do get your two combs in the front your one comb in the back as well as your adjustable straps and each of them has a center five inch deep lace part so with this unit the density on it is definitely more on the natural side if I had to guess it's about 130 percent it's not a super amount of hair but it's not super thin either I feel like it's right in the middle the texture on this is it's like a soft yakky it's definitely not on the slicky side so I am here for that the length on this one is pretty long and it comes below my boobs both of these units are about the same length both of them do come below my boobs the biggest difference between them like I was saying is the curl pattern this one is more of like a body wave relaxed vibe and the other one has more of a deep wave vibe and the other one also does seem a bit more full than this one the other one comes off as 150% without the curls combed out and the texture on both of these is a little bit different I feel like this one is easier to manipulate I didn't get much tingling or shedding with it at all the other one I definitely did get some more tingling shedding with it so definitely beware of that so both of these units are also coming off small medium and big head friendly so yes honey that's a good thing and let's just pop into the hairline on these units I feel like Bobby Boss has never really been the best with making hairline look super realistic they did each come with baby hairs but as far as that being pre-plugged like it's a little bit but like i feel like they gotta they gotta do something more because they only give you such tiny room and i'm not here for that so i feel like uh they need to be taking more notes from sensational and outro because i'm not really here for that hairline honey i feel like this is one i would have to put more work into to make it look realistic and i'm not I'm not here for that. Let's just jump into the cons and the pros of this unit. So my only con with this unit is just like the other one. It's just a hairline. I wish uh, Bobby Boss would step their game up a little bit more because either they're not, like their units are pretty cute, but I feel like they need to work more so on the hairlines of their units, making them look more realistic so that we don't have to put in more work because these other companies are here for the competition and bubby boss you're kind of slack and you kind of follow me high and you dig me so with the pros on this unit i do like the texture a lot i really like the look of it the length is nice the texture is nice um all in all, I do think these are both two really cute units. I think it all just depends on what look you're going for. The Patrice unit is just really cute if you want that super deep wave. They did an excellent job on the wave pattern. And I feel like this is cute if you just wanted like a simple day sort of like mid glam because this is not doing too much but it's doing just enough in my opinion so i really do like them both um i just feel like it all depends on what sort of look you're going for but i really do like both of them and i would recommend trying them out see how you feel about it um but in my opinion i honestly like this one better than the patrice because i feel like with the patrice I was getting a good amount of tingling and shedding, nothing too crazy, but some enough for me to know that that's not going to be an everyday unit unless I cut it down. So I feel like this is more tamed, and I could definitely see myself wearing this specific one, the Brienne, as an everyday unit. So that's just my own personal opinion, y'all. I hope this video was helpful for you guys. If it was, just make sure you give me a like, give me a subscribe, comment down below any of the units when I pick up and any of the colors. Make sure you head on over to Glam Shay's channel. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like. Make sure you watch her videos. And until then, I hope to see you guys soon. Bye. 
Burning the smoke as I close Waiting in the water, I've been drifting out to sea